charity for the story. Yeah. yeah. Excellent. <laughs> well, now, this is the story of a man called King Lear. And he lived very happily with his wife, Ava, and their four children. Fanula, Theocra, Ada, and Con. But unfortunately, one day, his wife passed away. And he was very sad. I think we should all go, Aww. 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 So months went by and his daughter, Fanula, said, Don't worry, father. I'll look after the other children. No problem. And he said, No, Fanula, you're too young. And so a couple of weeks later, a woman appeared at the fort. And who was it? but his wife's sister, Eva. Oh! And she said, Lear, I will become your wife and I will look after your children as if they were my own. So he was very happy. So they lived very happily and she used to play with the children and sing with the children and all went well for a while. And then she noticed that Lear was getting a little too, well, he was kind of avoiding her almost. And she got very jealous because all he did was play with the children. So one day, now pay attention children, <laughs> one day Aoife said to Lear, I know, I'll bring the kids swimming. And he thought, great. Off you go! So off she went down to the lake with the four children. And what do you think she did? No, I'm not going to tell you. She cast a spell on the children and said to them, she pointed, which was very rude, she pointed to them and said, you will turn into swans. Oh. Ooh. Thank you. Swans. <laughs> And for 900 years, three of which you will spend on this lake, another three on the Sea of Moyle, oh. I think we've all been there, oh. and another 300 on Inish Glara, that well-known holiday destination. <laughs> now, so with that, she returned back to the fort and said to Lear, and this was very bold, she said, Lear, she said, you're not going to believe it. Oh, you're not going to believe what's after happening. The children have drowned. And he said, no. I said, yes. <laughs> and he goes, wait a minute. And he ran down to the lake. And all that was there was four beautiful swans. But do you know what? The swans could still speak. So as Lear looked out to the lake, one of the swans said, Father, well, he nearly <laughs> passed out <laughs> with the fright. And he said, Fanula, is that you? And she said, yes, it's me, look. Oh. Well, he was very upset. And he said, what happened? And she said, well, I tell you, you know, your woman. And he said, who? And I said, mm, the wife, Eva. <laughs> and she said, what, the missus? And he goes, yes, she turned us into a swan. Well, he was fuming, so he ran back, and there was Eva, a la Kim Kardashian, <laughs> looking very snazzy in the outfit. She'd have jewels for her. She was thinking, great, the kids are off. It was marvellous. And he goes, Eva, you, mm, what the hell did you do? She goes, oh, I don't know what you mean. And I said, oh, yes, you do. And she goes, no, I do. And she goes, oh, you do. And she goes, well, you've spent too much time with them. So I turned them into swans. So there. <laughs> <laughs> well, he was devastated. And he was so angry. Now, he was as angry as, you know, when you stubbed your toe and you think, mm. it was that angry. And he says, right, he says, well, I know what I'm going to do to you. I'm going to turn you into a demon. <gasps> Collective. Ah! <gasps> so he turned her into a demon. 
off she went. He legged her down to the lake and said, I've gotten rid of your woman, but I can't. You, you're stuck. You're stuck like that. So Fnew said, look, we'll make the best of it, because she was very positive. She said, we'll make the best of it. We'll stay here for the 300 years. So Lear, every day, he brought them, you know, food, Burger King, McDonald's, everything. <laughs> but as the years went by, 300 years, he was getting old. And eventually, well, he, kicked the, uh, he passed away. He passed away dreadfully sad. Collective awe. Uh, so, 300 years. And then they thought, well, we have to go somewhere else. We have to go to the Sea of Moyle, which is like Magaluf on a bad day. <laughs> Awful. <laughs> so they went to the Sea of Moyle, and the weather was atrocious, no suntan, awful, awful, awful. And they thought, OK, well, we'd stick it out. Stuck in the Sea of Moyle for 300 years, getting older, and then, happy days, Bit of positivity. Oh, oh, thank you. Uh, they ended up in Inishglara. You've been there, Alva, yeah. it's lovely. Inishglara, the weather was nice, there wasn't enough wind. Well, there was a bit of wind, but it wasn't awful. And also, oh God, I didn't tell you the other part of the spell. Aoife, right, Aoife had said to them, only way to break the spell is if a holy man rings his bell. Huh? There you have you got that, Dylan? Yeah. He had to ring his bell. <laughs> so they end up in Inish Clara, right? They're going along, and clear to God, one of the days, towards the end of the 300 years, who's walking along? An old man, looked like a monk. They thought, oh, happy days. The monk sat down to do a bit of fishing. He's very happy. Doing his fishing, he's happy as Larry. The next thing, what, what do you think happened? Fanula, mouth almighty, turns round and goes, Excuse me! And he goes, Get around, I'm not Oh, God, what was He says, Have you, have you just spoken to me? He goes, Yes, response. And she regaled the spell and Eve and the whole thing. To be honest, it was a bit bored, but he let them go. And he went, yeah, yeah, I'm right. Oh, that's awful. And she said, and you are a monk or a priest? He said, yes, I am a holy man. Do you know what he did? He rang his bell. And they thought, fantastic. Fantastic, he said. <laughs> And do you know what happened? Collective awe. Aww. Aww. They turned back into humans. But unfortunately, and this is the sad bit, unfortunately, Aww. they were very, very old. Aww. And they passed away. Aww. But that night, the priest, he fell asleep and he dreamt of the four swans. And legend has it, Collective awe. Oh. Collective thank you. That wasn't great. I think we'll try that again. Ah! Oh. Oh. Huh? He dreamt, keep up. He, he dreamt of the four swans. And legend has it. It says, when you see a, when you see a swan, and you're very beautiful, one shall land on, on your, your head. head. <laughs> but obviously you have to be incredibly beautiful. <laughs> like me. Aww. And that's the end of our story. I thank you. Aww. Aww.